Good evening. Hello, good evening. How are you? I'm fine, thanks. A little bit tired because I I have finished my daily aerobic routine an hour ago. Okay, that's good. That you're so. healthy. <laughs> healthy and fit. <laughs> Congratulations. Well, I, I want to. <laughs> of course. How, are, how about you? How are you? I'm very today? tired as well because I finished, you know, I have another job. I finished that one and then I come to teach you class. And, uh, but it's nice. I really like to teach. Well, when you enjoy your work, it's not a... A, uh, a job <laughs> that is correct i mean i really i really enjoyed this one that's why i took these classes because i really really like them very nice okay we're going to wait for the other people to join the class just one or two more minutes Good evening. Hello, good evening. How are you? I'm fine, teacher. Perfect. Thank you. Welcome, welcome. Okay, my friends, we're going to start the class today. Welcome, everybody, and of course, uh, we hope that the other people join the class. And uh, the first question is, how is the platform going? Have you finished? Um, uh, do you have questions, comments about the platform? I finished the platform. Very well. You can print the certificate and everything will be fine. And... Uh, also, the next question is, uh, did you send already the papers for uh, the next level? Hey, yes, I, I sent yes. the last question. Okay. Very nice. So, if you have done that already, of course, everything will be fine. Okay, yesterday we were checking about the present perfect. Do you remember? So we're going to continue with the verbs. We checked just a few verbs, or just half of them. And today good we're evening. Going... Hello, good evening, Oli. How are you? Okay, so we're going to continue checking into the verbs, and then we're going to practice a little bit more some other information. So let's go for it. Okay, so we uh, yesterday repeated and used the verbs uh, on the left. So, as usual, we are going to check the meaning and then uh, one of you is going to give me an example. So, we are on the number 25, feel, felt, and felt. You know what is feel, right? What is to feel? Feeling. Good. Uh, Felix, Thank could you me. please tell me an example with, uh, with felt? And remember that we're going to use the present perfect. Okay. Um, I I have felt. No sé cómo dice. Bañar, ducharse, bañarse. Uh, 
a shower. You can say a shower. A shower uh, for the morning. Okay, that is good. Perfect. The next one is fight. And then we have the past participle that is fought. Uh, Oli, could you try? Let's see if you can help us with fought. I am done. Uh, today is is a uh, mad. Okay, don't worry. One valley. No full, no full. I, I don't know full. Okay, don't worry. That's fine. Okay, uh, thank you. Pat Patricia, could you please help us? Uh, okay. Uh, with uh, fault, right? Yeah, fault. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Um, have you ever fought? with your brother? Very good question, I liked it. The next one is fine. Do you remember what is fine? Everybody? Encontrar. Good. So, Encontrar. With, very nice, thank you. Found is going to be for Juan. Could you please help us with found? I found lots in the city. Okay, I found I myself loud. Yeah, we can say that. Uh, I found low money, money. I have found. Remember that we're going to use the auxiliary, I have. I have. Uh, I have found money. Yeah, that is a good mm. one. Okay. Okay, the next one is fly. What is to fly? Volar. 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 <laughs> So, I uh, fly to, I fly uh, alt. High, maybe. So, yeah, you Highs. can say. Yes, uh, hi. I, Estoy I, pensando I, en alto de otra forma. Okay. So, it's going to be, I have flown. Remember, yeah. that it's going to be have and flown. That is the past participle of the verb. Okay, the next one is get. Do you remember what is to get? Obtener. Obtener. Okay. The past participle is gotten, and this is for Mauricio. Could you please help us, Mauricio? I, I got him a good not in the a exam. Good, a good grade. Good. A good. Okay. <laughs> nice. The next one is give. What is give? That nice. Uh, Roxana, you're gonna help me with given. Given. I have given a gift to my mom. Okay. I have given gifts to my mom. Nice. Go. That is very easy, of course. Andrea, will you please help us with gone? I have go to the bathroom. Okay. I have um. gone to the bathroom, gone. Uh, the next one is uh, grow. What is grow? Crecer. Very good, crecer. Um, let's see. Alejandra, could you please help us with ground? Is not Andrea Alejandro there? I I am have grow a uh, uh, my house. Yeah, you can say I have grown. Uh, no, no, I know, I know. I have I have I I I have a grown my son. You can say, but that is a different verb. Maybe yeah. that is rice. Okay. Yeah, it's different. A grow is crecer, pero no, I am, um, I, I, uh, le quiero dar forma. Um, I hope uh, they grow. Yeah, but the book. grown mm -hmm. is for plants or for when you plant. grow, grew. No, plants, like plants. Yeah, it's for plants and also for people, but it's when, uh, I mean, if you say my son, En ese caso, no sería yo los, sino, le quedaría sino yo los he crecido a ellos. 
No, si, ajá, sino que es como ver crecer un árbol. I do see grow the tree. Yes? Yeah, you can say that. I have seen, but that is a different one because it's going to be see the verb. You can okay. say I have grown the plants, yeah, or I have grown in my house. That is another good because you're talking okay. about yourself. That is nice. Okay. Menos okay. mal que no iba a hablar, ¿verdad? <laughs> That's good. We are here to practice and learn. Okay. Have uh, is going to be for Josué, the uh, example we had. Yeah. We've had. Uh -huh. We've had. Okay. And the compliment can be anything, right? We had cars, for example. Okay. The next one is here. What is here? Oír. Very good. So that is going to be her. for Roxana. Could you please help me with her? I have her um, loud, loud noise. I've heard a long, uh, a noise, you can say that. Maybe it's a good idea to start contracting. Uh, I know that you can say I have heard, but uh, you can say I've, I've heard. I've, I've heard. And also you can use other uh, subjects. For example, she. Uh, in she, she is going to see is going to be she's. She's heard. Okay. You know that is not the verb to be, because the verb is in past participle, right? So she's is going to be she has. She that has. Is, that is going to be for sure. Okay, but the, the difference in the sentence is the verb in the yeah. past participle. That is the one. Yeah. You see the past participle and you know that that is, that she's, the contraction with the apostrophe and the S is has, it's not the verb to be. Okay. okay. The next one is for Juan. Could you please help us, Juan, with hide that is hidden? Uh, what, what is hide? Ah, oh, that is a good question. What is hide, people? Esconder. Esconder. I have, I hidden, I have hidden at home. I've hidden at home. Okay, very good. Hit, what is hit? Golpear. Golpear. Golpe. Golpe. Very good. Uh, Josue, could you please help us with uh, hit? I, I hit a riot. It's strong. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's not good, but anyways. Yeah, that is a good example. I hit. I hit riot. Well, not me, but you. <laughs> no, okay. I, I, I hit um, Maluma. I hit uh, I, um, the song music. Yeah, you can use that verb as well in that way. Yeah, he's hit. Okay. Okay. Um, okay, the next one is... Hold, that is going to be, what is hold? Es pendiente, esperar. Esperar, colgar, sostener, something like that. Agarrar. Okay. Hold is going to be a held, and this is for uh, Josue. Help us with that one, please. Um, I held my... Shocked. My video games. Okay, yeah, that is possible. I've held my video games. Uh, hurt, what is hurt? Hurt. Dolir. Dol uh, no, herir. Herir. Uh -huh. Así puede traducirse como doler, pero es ahí es, pero bueno, por ejemplo, pues decimos, it hurts, duele, ¿verdad? Pero es una adaptación. El verbo en sí es... No sé por qué tema. tenía la sensación de que se van a poner sentimental. Well, I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> Eric, it's, it's sentimental. Yeah, yeah, I do see. Yeah, I guess you're, you're right. <laughs> yes, uh, así. Um, ¿Cómo se dice? ¿Se le nota? I can see. I can see a sentimental. <laughs> ok. Es... Um, ¿Cómo es que se llama? Um, sensitive. Ok, sensitive. Yeah, that is true. Vamos right. a hacer una descripción. Mentira. 
Okay. Okay, hurt, so it's going to be like last Marble. Uh, this is going to be for Patricia. Okay. Mm. Um have um hurts. Hurts mm, can be his uh his hurt uh he's hurt my heart okay can he you my heart yeah that is possible hurt my heart okay number 39 is keep that is going to be guardar guardar mantener good kept is the past participle and it is for felix Okay. Uh, I have. I have kept my money in the bank. I kept my money in the bank. Very good. Nice. The next one is uh, no. No. What is to know? Conocer. Conocer. Saber. Nice. Uh -huh. The past participle is known, and this is going to be for Jasmine. No. Um, I know. I know the price of tomatoes. Okay. <laughs> Good. That is nice. Thank you. The next one is nil. Do you know what nil is? Arrodillarse. Arrodillarse. Okay. And uh, knelt uh, is going to be for Roxana. Help me with that one, please. I knelt. Mm -hmm. I knelt uh, to God. <laughs> okay, I uh, knelt to God. That's good. Nice. The next one is uh, learn. That is easier, right? Learn, yeah. That is going to be for Mauricio. Uh, knelt. Uh, I'm sorry, learned. I, I have learned English in, in the Insafor course. Okay, that's a good one. Perfect. Nice. Now is leave. What is leave? Es como nivel. Leave the heart. The heart, abandonar. Good. This is going to be left and it's going to be for Juan. I left the keys at the car. I've left in the keys in the car. Okay. In the car. That's not good, but anyways, it's a good example. Okay, the other one is loose. loose. What is loose? Perder. Okay, last. So last is going to be for Josue. Okay, uh, I have lost myself. Okay, I lost <laughs> I myself. Lost my... Okay. Make. The other one is make. make. What is make? A ser. Okay, a ser. So the uh, past participle is made. And this is going to be for Oli. Could you please try to help? Um, I am have make a meeting um, everything. Okay, I've made a meeting. You can say that. I, yes. I gather people. Mean, what is mean? Significar. Significar, okay. And the past participle is meant. Meant. Roxana, could you please help us with that? I don't know. Mean is very uh, useful when you want to ask another person, uh, when you want to understand what other people said. So, do you uh, do you, have you seen on the on the on the movies that they say, "What do you mean?" Right? What do you mean is like, "What do you want to say?" I don't understand you. And you can mm -hmm. use that one also uh, in the past participle with the present perfect. What um, I meant was different. So, for example, uh, for example, I meant 
I've meant uh, the question. I've meant to ask a question, yeah. Very good. Okay, so these are just a few verbs. Remember that the regular verbs are going to be the same. But the um, irregulars are the ones that we need to pay attention to. Some of these verbs, probably the most of them, is going to be the same in uh, simple past and past participle. But there are some of them that are different. So the only way for you to do well this topic is to learn those verbs. Okay. Of course, we are going to continue practicing. Okay, we have some sentences so we can practice. This one uh, are going to be affirmative. So we're going to uh, transform this one into present perfect. The first one, how is it going to be? I have studied French. I have studied French. Good. Study. Number two. She has yeah. eaten octopus. Eating octopus. She eating has octopus. eaten octopus. Would you like to try octopus sometime? Have you tried octopus sometime? No, I haven't eaten octopus. Okay. Nice. Yes, in, in the cocktail? Yeah, in cocktails. Oh. Good, right? Yeah. It's so, delicious. It's I don't delicious. know. <laughs> no, you. Nice. Yes, I, I mojitos delicious. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, with mojitos, I could tell with octopus it would be. Good. Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Number three, how is it going to be? They have gone to Scotland. Very good. They have gone to Scotland. Nice. Number four, how is it going to be? We have we read, read that, that, book. Book. That, read that, that book. Very good pronunciation, remember. We have read, 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 read. that book. Read okay. that book. Number five. He has, he has lived he has here for three here for years. years. Live here for three years. I don't That's know that it. Good. No te vi. He has lived y las clases, here no tenés clases. for three years. So sorry. <laughs> don't worry. Number six, how is it going to be? You have, you have known, known David, David for, David 10, for years. 10 years. Very good. You have known David for 10 years. Number seven. It's the same mamá regañona, ya vieron, ¿verdad? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we have been here we for two weeks. We have been here for two weeks. Very good. We have two been weeks. here for two weeks. It, this one is very good, I mean. It's not the same to say uh, we have been that we have gone. We have gone yep. means that you went and came back. We have been is that you went and you are still there. Okay. Mm -hmm. So it's the meaning is totally different. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we have been here for two weeks. Number eight. I have lost my I have my case. I have lost my keys. I have lost my keys. Good. Number nine. He has drunk, he drunk he has much, so much coffee. coffee. He drunk. has drunk too he much has coffee. Drunk. Okay. Too much coffee. Too Macchiato, much pongamosle ahí. Okay, that's a good one. <laughs> macchiato. Too much mo mojito. Yeah. The <laughs> <laughs> well. coffee, macchiato. Macchiato. Okay. Dulce de leche. <laughs> okay. I okay. dream is mojitos. Yeah, we need to go some, some time to do that one. <laughs> yeah, okay. it's super delicious. <laughs> <laughs> okay, number 10, how is it going to be? They have missed, they have missed, missed the, train. the train. They missed, missed the train. Nice. Like so they are number 11. Um, she, she has, has gone, gone, to, she Peru. Has gone to, Peru. to Peru. Very good. She's gone to Peru. So number twelve. We, we have eaten we much have chocolate. Much chocolate. Much chocolate. chocolate. Well, I know like chocolate. No really. <laughs> yeah. Hi. Well, it's delicious. I, I know. Uh, I different person. <laughs> okay, that's Jesus. good. I know. No, no chocolate. Chocolate. 
I, 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 <laughs> nothing, de ninguno. Okay, not at all. <laughs> okay, yeah. yeah, that is going to be, we've eaten too much chocolate. Nice. Chocolate. Number 13. I have... I have had breakfast this morning. That is it, right? I, I have, have had. had. Yeah, I, I, I have, have had. <laughs> yeah, that is good. I have <laughs> have. I have had. I have had. Number 14. John, John has, has missed, missed the, train. the train. John has missed the train. John's missed the train. Good. Number 15. Lucy, Lucy has, has cooked breakfast. breakfast. Lucy has cooked breakfast. Hey, y los hombres no hay, no hay menas. In Solo this one, chicas. In this one, no, but maybe the other. <laughs> Number 16. They have... They written, have right into the presentation. Okay. They, Álvaro, el único written. que da la cara. Pronunciation is written. Remember that. Written. written. Yeah, they written. written to politicians. Nice. Okay. Okay, the number uh, 17 now. You have, you have found, found, found your wallet. Your wallet. You, have... you found your wallet. Very good. Number 18. Oh, I have, I have met, I have met the mother. Met his mother. Good. I've met. Met. I met. met his mother. Number 19. We, we have, we have, we have tried, tried roller, roller, roller skating. skating. Okay. Skating. We tried roller skating. Do you know what is roller skating? Patines. Patines, patina. That is it. So we've tried roller skating. And the number 20. She it has passed the, the, the exam. exam. Good. She she's passed the exam. Nice. She's passed exam. Okay. Now we're when going you speak, to... it's better that uh, you contract. Uh, you speaking with the the auxiliary in contractive form. It's better. It's better. It's better. So you practice that. It's more fluently. Yeah. 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 Because in the future you are going to be talking very fluent. Uh huh. And you need to be careful about pronunciation. So. The other person understands what you what you're saying. Um, okay. Okay. These ones are going to be a negative. Number one. We, we not haven't gone, gone to, no. Paris. to Paris. To Paris. To Paris. Paris. We haven't gone to Paris. Number two. She hasn't, she seen, hasn't the seen the Lord, the Lord of, of the Rings. Of the Rings. Of the Rings. She hasn't seen the Lord of the Rings. Good. The Lord of the Rings the is of the one of them of my favorite uh, movie. Really? The Lord it's, of the Rings. It's very, very good, actually. I really like that one. <laughs> okay, I, uh, like. Number... So I like the movie. I know. I'm with Larga. <laughs> but it's very good. I mean, you. Yeah. I, I, I enjoyed that one. <laughs> so, uh, number three. He hasn't met he my mother. He hasn't met my mother. He hasn't met Juan. my mother. Good. <laughs> Number sure. four. Uh, they, okay. haven't, they, have no, they haven't visited St. Uh, Paul's. St. Paul's. St. Paul's. Yeah. Yeah. They haven't visited St. Paul's. Good. St. Paul's. Uh, somebody had a question they had. Yes, me. Okay. Uh, with the contraction form, uh, the correct form of the contraction is, for example, in the four, is they haven't, right? Haven't, yeah. Uh, I can say they've, or, or for example, in three, I can say he's not, or yeah. he's not correct. Yeah, you can yeah. say that as well, yeah. Okay. He's oh, yeah. not met. In contracted, when you contract the he has, uh -huh. he's I not. I contract two in... in in two forms, right? Yeah, two ways. you can contract in, in two ways, okay. yeah. The most common, of course, is they haven't, but you can do it. That is not a problem. Oh, okay. Thank you. Okay, nice. He uh, hasn't or he's not? Yeah. Met he or, or he hasn't not. not. 
That is correct. Yes. So, uh, number five. five. I haven't known. I haven't known, have known for three months. His, him for three months. Him for three, three months. months. Good. I haven't three. known him for three, three months. For three months. <laughs> number six. You, have you haven't studied, studied for French for, for 10 years. years. For 10 years. Okay. You haven't studied French for 10 years. Study it. Number seven. They, they haven't, haven't been, been in London for six months. They haven't been in London for six months. Good. They haven't months. been in London for six months. Number months. eight. He hasn't heard, he hasn't hasn't heard, heard his, his legs. legs. His, his legs. legs. His legs. legs. Good. He has heart a, is hard. It's the same. Hard, hard, hard. Yes. Yeah, that is the same. Exactly. Good. Okay. Uh, number nine. She, she has, has she left, has left, left, left in a taxi. her phone in a, phone in a taxi. In a, in a taxi. Good. She hasn't in a, left her phone in a taxi. Left. Number ten. We, we haven't, haven't lost, lost tickets. our tickets. Our tickets. Tickets. We haven't tickets. lost our tickets. Nice. Lost our tickets. Okay, now we go to number 11. She hasn't made dinner. She hasn't made dinner. Number 12. They, they haven't arrived yet. Not arrived yet. Arrived. They haven't arrived yet. Arrived yet. Number 13. Lucy, Lucy hasn't done, done her, done her, done her homework. homework. Good. Lucy hasn't done right. her, homework. her homework. Number 14. I, I haven't read, 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 read that book. I haven't read that book. Good. Book. Number 15. He hasn't, he hasn't lived, 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 lived in Berlin. 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 He hasn't lived in Berlin. Good. Not Berlin. Berlin. Berlin is the pronunciation. B Berlin. That. Berlin is Berlin. Good. Berlin. 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 Good. Yeah. Number 16. John, John hasn't, hasn't, hasn't any any food. bought any food. John hasn't bought any food. Bought. Uh, bought. 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 Okay. Bought. That's bought. the one. Number 17. She hasn't cleaned the kitchen. She hasn't cleaned the kitchen. Good. Number 18. Oh, the chicken. <laughs> you, have you, me. Called, you haven't called, called, me. called me. You haven't called call me. Call Please me. call me. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Number 19. We, we haven't, haven't found, found the, the book yet. The book yet. The book yet. <laughs> We haven't found the book yet. Good. Yes, found. 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 Okay. And number 20. They haven't they have let us sleep well. Slept they well. Yeah, slept they well. haven't slept well. Nice. Slept well. Okay, of course, we have a last part that is questions. Okay. Okay, number one, how is it going to be? Have you read War and Peace? Peace. Peace. Yeah. Peace. Have you read War and Peace? Have you read that book? Read. That is a very large book. No. Yeah, I love it. It's a red book. Yeah, it's, but that book is very large. It's very, very, and it's very interesting, but War it's... And peace. Yeah, it's, it's kind of... I just, I just know that book, but in Charlie Brown... <laughs> Ah, okay, yeah, that is true. true. Yeah, appears in many, many uh, stories, Army. movies, and many things. Okay, um, I I love I I I love it. Read a book. Um, about um, uh, no light. Um, everything. Yeah, some books are different. I mean, we have. Yes. Um. Eh, pero se ha perdido, siento yo en los jóvenes la lectura. That is true, that is true. They now only YouTube and things like that, right? No, yes. es solo um, teléfono. Yeah. I am phone. 
only on the cell phone. Mm. Okay, number two, who is going to be? Uh, she be late for a meeting. For a meeting. Late for the meeting. Has she been late for a meeting? Late for a meeting. Very good. Number three. Has, Has he, he met your family yet? Has he met your family yet? Family. Number four. Have they Have lived they here lived as long here as, as we long have? As we have. As we have. <laughs> Well, have they lived here as long as we have? That is a very good question. And um, number five. Have you ever have gone, you gone, gone to, to Australia? Australia? Australia. Have you gone to Australia? Good. Number six. Has she, has she missed, missed the bus? bus? Has she missed the bus? Good. Missed the bus. And number seven. Have uh, I met your meeting before? before? That is also a very common question in English. Have Have I met I you met before? You before? Okay. Number uh, eight. Eight. Have, have they, they taken they the, they exam? the exam? Good. Have they taken the exam? Taken the exam. Taken. Number nine. Has she, she worked work work in, in the company, company, for, company 15 for 15 years? 15 years. Good. Has she worked in this company for 15 years? years. And uh, number 10? How long has How she, long she, long she has lived in London? London? Has she lived in London? Uh, that is a WH question, as you can see. How long yeah. has she lived in London? Good. Okay, let's continue with number 11. Where, where, where have you been? Where, where, been? Have, you been? where, where, you where been? have you been? Good, where? that is a very common question. Where have you where, been? Where I was been? doing something, I don't know. It could be anything. Number 12. How much, How much coffee, coffee have, you have you drink, drink, you drink, drink today? today? Yes, um, I am. I drink five. <laughs> five cups of coffee. That is a lot. Though. Five cups of coffee. <laughs> a lot of. I need a lot of cup of you coffee. energy. <laughs> okay, that's good. Yeah. Okay, yes, this is going to be how much coffee have you drunk today? So, yes. number 13. What? What, what have, have you done, have you done, done, done today? today? Right. Very common question as well. <clears throat> what have you done today? Nice. Nice. Number, very nice. Number 14. How, How long, long has, long has, has long he worked work work here? Work here? Work here. How long work. has he worked here? Nice. Number 15. Why have I come to I don't remember the brown. 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 Yeah. Brown. Why have you brown? Why have you brown that? that? Brown, brown that. that. Brown. Okay, number brown, that. 16. How, How many, how many times Scotland? Yeah, Scotland. how many times Scotland. have you visited, you visited Scotland? Visited Scotland. Good. Number 17. How many, how many, many books have you read? read? This, this, this I, I can this, see this, it. <laughs> Ah, really? My... Ah, because of that, yeah. Yeah. How many books have you read this week? Okay. Okay. Yeah. Number... This week. Number 18. How, how long, long, long have you, you, how long you, have you studied English? English? How long um, have you studied English? Study. How long have you studied English by now? How long? Yeah. Oh long? My God. I yeah, have studied the... English yeah. for more than 10 oh. years. Many years. For, for three years, I think. Okay. I four years. No, so, I four. Four months. Four months. Okay. Yeah, everybody different, right? Yeah. Okay. The uh, next one, uh, number nineteen. Um, how much food do you have to? Have to, have to bought? Have bought? Bought? That's it. Um, how much food have you bought? Bought. Um, bought. I have. I have problem when I, I 
want to pronounce that ba, bought, bought, bought. and brown, brown. <laughs> with the this kind of verb in, in past participle. I have problem. Yeah. But that's what we're practicing to yeah. identify first and then you can continue practicing. Okay. So number 20, how's it going to be? Have, have they gone to the USA? Have they gone to the USA? Good. That is USA. it. As you can see, if your practice is going to be very, very easy. Of course, uh, what, as you can see also here in these questions, you are going to use this um, to ask about some things that you have done. Uh, experiences most likely have you gone have you eaten have you drunk white wine or anything like that right so most likely it's going to be for that uh, also you can use this with other kind of grammar and that's I know that you know this one but anyways we're going to check already and yet so already Already means that something happened earlier uh -huh. than we expected. With present perfect, uh, we usually uh, use already after uh, the auxiliar have or has and before the main verb. So, for example, I've already seen that film. I don't want to see I that. Film. Seen that film. Or we can say, Arriving at the bus station, I found the bus had already left. left. And uh, have you already taken the money? Okay. Has he all? Uh, sorry, he has already done the shopping. He has He's watching TV. Shopping. So position here is very important. In affirmative, remember that it's going to be after the auxiliar. I've already. She's already. Of course, in the question is going to be different because we change, we move the auxiliar. Have you already, right? Has he already? And then the verb, okay? We have more examples. Mark has already here, but John hasn't come yet. Uh, there is missing the, the verb, I guess. Mark has already been here, gone here, come here. Then we have, she has finished the test already. That is a good example. We can use also already at the end of the sentence. That is possible as well. The most common, wow. the most common is after have or has, okay? After the auxiliary. Yeah. And we have yet, that is kind of the opposite, right? Yet means that something that we expected has happened or hasn't happened. We usually put it at the end of the sentence. For example, Michael has bought a new dress, but she hasn't worn it yet. As you can see at the end of the sentence. He hasn't watered the flowers yet. Okay. It hasn't been decided yet. We haven't been able to solve the problem yet. She won a negative, a negative statement. You use yet. Yeah, you can use yet that one because that means, for example, in that one, uh, it hasn't been decided yet. It means that we want that to be decided, but still not. not it's not um, happened. Uh -huh. So the other one says she won't have sent the email yet. Okay. And uh, let's see. It hasn't been decided yet. Uh, well, we read that already. And you may not have noticed it yet. That is very common as well. Have you met your new neighbors yet? So already is when something already happened or and maybe you didn't know that it happened and yet it's when it's still not happening and you are asking about that one or you're providing information about that about the situation that's still not happening i believe it's very easy but i don't know if you have any question
questions about already and yet? In, in already in Spanish is como ya o. Yes, it's something like that. Ya lo hice, ya pasó, ya se terminó, mm -hmm. something like that. O ya no lo hice, it can be something like that. Okay, and the other one is todavía, no, right? Not mm -hmm. yet. Okay, also we have other pieces of information that we use with the present perfect, since and for. We can say, for example, I've been living in Spain since 2012. Okay. And, uh, well, since we're going to use that plus the point in time in the past, or since plus the starting point, and continues until now, okay? And uh, yeah, the most of the time you are going to use four plus the time, the time expression, okay? Um, for example, uh, well, we have, uh, let me just check the other grammar. We have the other part that is four. Uh, we're going to use four when uh, a period of time you have been doing an activity and here is like the formula four plus the period of time that is how you're going to be for six years for nine months for example or for the number and time word for five minutes for six months for example and this is when we measure the duration of something or how long it lasts. So this is like a period of time. We're going to use a four for a period of time. It has a start point and an end point and can be used in different tenses. So this is not only for the present perfect. You can use that for other tenses as well. So for example, I studied English in Ireland for two years. As you can see, that is simply past. I studied English in Ireland for two years. That means that the activity finished. I will be there for around two months. So yes, we can use that for the future as well. We're going to. We have been married for 16 years. That is a period of time. Okay. And there are some other time expressions for 10 minutes for eight hours, for five days, for six months, for three years, for two centuries. That is like the most common. Now, if we check about since, we're going to use since with a starting point, not a period of time, but a starting point, or we can use since plus a time or a date. Okay. When something started in the past and continues until now. Since is mostly used in the present perfect and perfect progressive tense. We don't know that yet. Don't worry about that. So, he hasn't eaten since 7 o'clock. I've been working here since June. We have been married since 2002, okay? That is a specific time. I guess here we can compare with the other one. We have been married for 16 years. That is a period of time. And the other one is since 2002. That is a starting point, right? And uh, there are other time expressions that we can use with since. Since eight o'clock, since Monday, since February since 1982, since I left school, since the end of the last century. Okay, so similar but not the same. Okay, it's very important that. Do you have a question with for instance? No. The dog has a question. Scarlet. Desde. Since is desde, yeah. That is it. Okay. Spanish. Let's practice. Yes.
Okay, we're going to uh, decide if we're going to use for since just already and yet. Just is when you just recently did something. Do you remember? I just, I have just finished my homework. Okay. okay, number one, it says, my son went to the supermarket, but he hasn't come back. Come back, yet. Come back. yet. Good, that is going to be yet. Nice. Um, a good thing is this example. You can see that we can use two tenses in the same phrase or sentence. Very interesting. My son went to the supermarket, but he hasn't come back yet. yet. Simple past and present perfect. So together. Interesting that we are going to use some words as connectors, like but, okay? But, and, then, things like that are going to put the two sentences together. So that is very interesting as well. Number two, how is it gonna be? Leonard has already, already? Already made his already bed. made his bed, uh -huh. but he hasn't called his girlfriend yet. Yeah, together the two of them. Leonard has already made his bed, uh, but he hasn't called his girlfriend yet. As you can see, but again is putting everything together. Okay, number three, how's it gonna be? Miriam has lived in Morocco since she was 10 years old. Good. Miriam has lived in Morocco since she was 10 years old. Yeah, it's Morocco starting. is Marruecos. That is it, yeah. Okay. Good, good. Pero uh, I am, um, I guess Marruecos, um, Morocco is but uh, yeah but that is in english that's that is okay new. number uh four how is it gonna be we have already have met, already met the, the new teacher, teacher at the high, high, high school, school. Nice school. good high school. we have already met the new teacher at the high, the high school. school nice number five the waiter the waiter has, has, has Ya no vimos más arriba. The weather has already found. Already. The weather has already. It can be already. I guess might be good. Probably I will use just. Yes. The weather has yes. just. Me some coffee, coffee and, and biscuits. biscuits. Um, and just is the another option in the yeah uh, if you go here you can see that we can use four since just oh yes already, already yet. okay yeah so in my opinion is is possible or maybe it's better just but already also fits so it matches okay uh, mm -hmm. that was number five so how is going to be number six have they visited London? They visited London. They haven't already gone through. No, they haven't. Okay. So the first one is going to be Have they visited London yet? And the other one? They haven't already gone there. They haven't already gone there. Okay, very good. Nice. Let's see number seven. That man, that man has, has uh, come late again. Yes. His boss is very angry with her. <coughs> Repeat okay. with that, that man please. has. Uh -huh. Just has just yeah. come late come again. Late again. That is okay, thank his you. boss is very angry with him. That is it. So that man has just come late, come late again. again. His boss is very angry with him. Good. As you can see in this and the number seven, when you don't use a connector, we are going to separate the two sentences with a period. So that is also very common, okay? Number eight, how's it gonna be? 
as the girl as leaves the girl leaves in the five years. Four and five years. Four, five five years. years. Yes, she arrived five, five years. years ago. Five, five years ago. Okay, that is it. Has the girl lived in France for five years? France. Yes, she arrived five years ago. Good. So, number nine. The play the has flown for 12 hours. For 12 hours? Four hours. Good. The plane has flown for 12 hours. hours. Nice. Number 10. The businessman the has worked in the same office, in the office since he was 25 years old. He was 25 years old. Okay, the businessman has worked in the same office since he was 25 years old. Was 25 years old. Years. Very good. Number 11. There has there been, has been an, accident an accident on this on road, this road, this road since last year. Since so there has been last many accidents uh, on this road since last year. So since last, last year. year. Yeah. Like, yeah. Because last year is was like a period, I mean, not a period of time, but a starting point since last year, um, right? That is good. So number 12. John has, has performed perform the, the same, same play play for a long time. For a long time. Long time. Yeah. A long. Four. Four. John has performed for a long time. Same playing for a long time. Good. Number 13. The woman, woman, woman has sold her car, yet. car but she, yes. wants she wants to sell it. But she, she wants to sell it. That's it. The woman hasn't sold her car yet, but she wants to sell it. Good, good. I, what about number 14? I have no my boyfriend. I have, I have, no, I my have boyfriend. no my boyfriend we were at the uh, since we were at primary school. Good. I have known my boyfriend since we were at primary school. Primary school. Good. Okay, so now you can see here that there is uh, there are many ways mm -hmm. for you to use the present perfect. Uh, it's very common. I mean, simple present tenses and uh, present continuous, the simple past and the present perfect probably are the most common tenses. So if you manage these four tenses, you can speak very well, okay? So it's very important for you to try to learn the, the verbs and try to use it. Uh, because sometimes happens that we only use one or two tenses, right? But we can use, we can enrich the way that we speak. Mm -hmm. to, uh, tomorrow we are going to continue with a second practice similar to this one. So uh, by now, do you have any question? Mm -hmm. No teacher, any question? No, I got it. Okay, so my friends, it was a pleasure to be here with you tonight. I hope you have a wonderful night and see you tomorrow. Thanks, teacher. Thanks. Good, Good night. night. Good see night. Tomorrow. Good night. Also see remember, you tomorrow. See also tomorrow. remember that tomorrow is the last day to submit the papers for the next mm -hmm. level. So if you haven't, please do it. Okay. 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 Good night. Night. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night, teacher. Good night.